हाई फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल मैं हूँ ऋतिका दुर्गापाल फ्रॉम माई चैनल ऋतु ब्लॉग्स एंड यर वी आर एट द वर्ल्ड लार्जेस्ट चर्च इन यम सुक्रो दैट इज़ द कैपिटल ऑफ कोदी वार वी स्पीक एज आईवरी कोस्ट इन इंग्लिश I'm here in Kothiwar since four years, but this was the first time when I visited to the church, and I wanted to visit and see the world largest church. And mind it, if you are from Kothiwar, you can't miss out this place. It's just beautiful. Takes three hours from Abidjan to reach over here, and you have to pay an entrance fees of two thousand sifa. So here we are going in an entrance, and first we are going to have some juice and snacks. You can go to the canteen and have some juice or snacks before you begin to the momento, as it is going to take you one hour, one and a half hour, depending upon your interest. So this is a view from canteen, and you can see how huge it is. And I'm very excited to know the story about this. As you know, greenery is a beauty of Africa. Wherever you go, you will find beautiful flowers, plants, tree. and it's near to nature and what i love about this country is this greenery so we are moving towards a momento and i'm really excited to know about this place and uh, you will find a guide who will speak english chinese french so according to your convenience you can search a guide and take a tour and you have to take a guide because the guide is the one who will tell you what is the place all about how it is built and everything all knowledge you will get through the guide so you need a guide to roam over this place so here we are this is the inside part and you can see the pillars these are around 84 pillars and it's quite huge i can't capture in the camera and tell you how huge it is but when you are going to see it you will realize yeah it is too huge and uh, the one thing you are not allowed to take the picture till 34 meters because this gate height is 34 meter and it is built with the mirrors and it says that if you are going to click the picture it can damage due to flash lights and everything this mirrors can get damaged so till 34 meters you can't take the picture outside you can take the picture but not inside the church and uh, about 34 meters are outside part of the church you can click the pictures as you want so see the entrance you can see it's looking so beautiful this is a small inside video i took for you all Here they see that the center part represents a spirit that is pass on through sky. The blue part represents a sky, and this represents the twelve persons. And down there are twenty four gates, which represents the twenty four stories of the Bible. So this is the small inside view. Here they are around forty eight pillars plus twelve pillars. There are escalators till thirty four meters. Above that, there is more eighty two meters. But there is a step, and only for cleaning the persons are allowed to go. On the entrance door, there is a Mother Mary picture with an open hand who is welcoming you to the Our Lady of Peace. There are around twenty four doors of the same size. Each door weight around two tons. And the way they are built, you can move them with a single finger. So this all knowledge the guide has given to us, which I am sharing with you all. And if you are excited to know about this place and you are from Kothiwar, you should surely visit to this place and know more about this place. So here we are waiting for a guide to come. As I speak very less French, so I wanted an English guide, and he was really too good. The way he has explained us very nice. The capacity of inside is around eighteen thousand people, eleven thousand standing, and uh, seven thousand sitting. And my Prasha daughter is also vlogging for me. She loves to hold camera and click the pictures. So our guide is here, and now we are moving toward the place and know more about the place. Here to the church, this you can see it is a place of fathers and priests who pray over here. They stay there only, and uh, yeah, we are on now the back side of the place. And uh, after this, we'll see one more two statues, and then we are going to go 34 meters high. Here he is going to click a nice picture for you. Now we are going upstairs, and uh, we reached in just 24 second, 34 meters high. Here you are allowed to use cameras, and you can click the pictures. 
normally here there is not even a single light only when there is a big ceremonies from this blue part some lights are hand and uh, you can see the view from the top here there is no sound echo only in the center part where the priest and father is sitting they speak that sound as echo otherwise there is no sound echo in any of the part the branches are built in such a way that the sound is not getting echo here back side you can see the light that lights are hanged this lights are hanged when there is any big ceremony or something you can see on the wall the cross marks and the square marks because of which the sound is not getting echo here where we are standing and we are speaking the sound is not getting echo even if this place is so huge and there are no so many people over here so that is the way the construction has been done it took completely 3 years 1500 employees working day and night the person who has constructed this building the same person has constructed the sofitel hotel in apichan and uh, you can see the way the construction has been done the construction has been started in july 1986 and completed in september 1989 with 1500 workers working day and night the ma it is all about work with a marble and marbles has came from spain italy and uh, i think third one is a china i didn't remember the third place from where this marble has been came here he is explaining us how the light has been hanged during ceremony when there is a ceremony how the lights is hanged been hanged and uh, how the person goes for a cleaning over there Uh, we are at 34 meter above this there is more 82 meters so the height of the church over here is 120 meters from inside and this cross mark and square marks are the there with due due to which the sound is not getting echo here each and everything represents something so you have to hear it nicely like in center there are four pillars which represents a four person who has created a new bible who has written the new bible so each and everything represents something here you can see the stairs if you don't want to use escalators the people use the steps to come this 34 meters height now we are moving to the other part this is a top terrace where there is one room in which the structure has been presented here it is all the pick how the construction has been started who has done the construction how the construction process the different parts picture half construction done half is pending like that in part the pictures has been given over here then all the weathers from all the parts how it looks like the pictures are here and you can see it's looking so beautiful in all weather how does this church look likes from here you can see the foundation of the yam sukro which is a governing office where all the president meetings has been conducted that you can see over here you see the two columns left and right have a opening hand like that just to say welcome to us in the church okay the diameter of this door down yeah the door down is a 20 meters okay the symbol of holy spirit this is a the door down Hmm. Okay. That the up, the crown, the golden part is not some gold, some aluminum which is anodized. The weight of this part is a 320 tons. 320 tons. tons. The so, upper part. Yeah. Only the upper part. Yeah. That they took they used 17 hours to put it there. Okay, 17 <laughs> hours to only put that. Yeah. Uh the cross mark. Yeah. Cross mark is how much? The golden part. That 320 tons. 320 tons. tons. Oh my God. <laughs> They use a uh, hydraulic uh, pump to put it there. One of the best places I visited yet, and I just love this place. The positivity. I think it's just amazing. The view 
remove the four pillar from down side and we are back now so it's a final round and I'm taking us some view and pictures for you all you can see from entrance how the church looks like it's so beautiful and I just love this place so wanted to share with you all that that wants to visit the church and have a tour over here so we are going back i hope you like this video if you like the video please do hit the like button and if you are new to my channel please do subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon so you get the latest update of my new videos soon i will be coming up with the video on yam sukro tour if you are planning two days weekend in yam sukro so what you can do over there soon i am going to come up with that till that time be happy be healthy and stay safe